Hey guys, this is Cake on the Thousand. This is another not of our regular type of videos. Actually, this will probably be on Cake of Two Thousand and Cake of Vlogs, just to give you guys a look at what Cake of Vlogs may be. Anyways, um, basically today we're gonna rant again, and I'm here with Mr. Munchie. And hey I guys. Your phones out. Yeah, he's gonna help us really just back us up. <laughs> I guess I'll be the main one. I just get off the top of my head, so it might not be so good, but especially with the pressure of him here. Um, today's topic is why people think they're better than other people. Like, how did that start anyways? From, like... It probably started from, like, when there were kings. Like, king, I'm so much better than you. I get to rule you. How did they determine the kings anyways? Now, I get it. Some people want leaders, okay? But why can't we all step up and be leaders? What happened to separating ourselves? Like, why did that happen? Why did we separate ourselves? Why couldn't we work together? Why didn't money become a thing? Why couldn't we toughen up and work and then share? <laughs> like, are we spending money to go down in mines or are we just spending time? Time that we can get back. Time that we could spend having fun with others and not having to worry about being homeless on the street. And then people who drive by homeless people and then start talking about them like they're better how are you better than that person okay yeah like y you can go watch videos on youtube some are like really inspiring they see people who are giving homeless people 500 hundred dollar bills and then you can see others where like there's rich people treating them like trash like they're basically a bag of garbage on the street, which doesn't make any sense because they're people too, even though they might have messed up their lives or they might not be as wealthy as you. Yeah, they're still people. Like, they can get help. There's rehab centers. How about you go help them? You know, some of them have mental illnesses. And people talk about them like, oh, they can get help. It's their fault. Well, what if they don't know how to get help? How about you go out and you help them? I get it. Okay, stranger danger. But still, I mean, you can bring um, rehab people to them. And I get it. Some people don't want to give them money because they're afraid they'll just use it for drugs. But really, maybe instead of giving them money, you can give them, buy them a meal. Yeah, exactly. Um, And also, um, you know, people wouldn't be homeless if, like I said before, we just shared. Like, what's our point? Like, why us, as human beings, do we always have to try to keep things for ourselves? I don't understand. People are always like, sharing is caring. But are you really sharing? Why is there money? Why are we split up? Why do we try to kill each other? Why do we try to be the dominating country? It doesn't make sense. Like, can't we just be one one just like different places and why do we have to be split up between the races too like that makes no sense okay there's still racism there's still not equality still sexism and it's just it's i don't even see the point of racism or sexism either like we're it's it's so stupid like you're you're black i'm asian correct yeah we're, we still have hearts, we still have brains, we're still people, we still have feelings, we can still get hurt and we can also hurt others. Or we could help others, which should, which should be what we're doing. We should be helping, building e each other up, helping them, instead of always putting others down or making them feel discouraged or anything like that. You always want to build people up, you want to help them. Exactly! I couldn't have said it better, like, why? And, like Timmy said, we all are basically the same, okay, we may have different feelings sometimes, right, we may change those feelings and stuff, but if someone over here, okay, and I can't say I haven't done this, because I have, and I regret it, but if there's somebody with a mental illness, and they do something, and then you laugh at them, that's just, that's so mean, because they don't know what they're doing, and they may take us as the dumb ones, so really, you need to think about that, before. And that happens, that happens a lot on social media, too. You could see, like, someone pulling a joke, or someone just does something embarrassing. And they maybe take something from a little laugh, like, haha, that was a little funny, it's over now. They could take something from that, post it all over social media. They have no friends in school. They don't have anything anymore. They're basically, like, nothing anymore. 
So people can make something so small into something so huge. It's then, just ridiculous. Exactly. And then they want to kill themselves over it. Do you know what you did? You could be counted as a murderer for that. Because it was your fault. I and it's happened on, before. Exactly. I know on the news, um, this one girl, she killed herself because uh, she was being bullied on social media. And these kids at her school were, like, throwing rocks at her and chasing her home. And then they... There were, like, four of them, two boys and two girls, and they ended up going to jail for that because they broke her. They made her go to the point of killing herself. And That's also, terrible. what what is the point of bullying? Exactly. Like, you, like, no one needs a bully. Doesn't it make you feel better? Like... Put it doesn't make it, that it goes back it goes back to our first topic making why do people think that people are so superior over each other the, just because you could be better at something you're a faster runner you're a stronger person it doesn't make you any better of a person than anyone else you could have someone living in a bubble and someone is the best track marathon runner winning all the awards it doesn't mean that they have more rights it doesn't mean that they should be treated differently. Everyone should be treated the same, no matter if you have a disability or anything. If you're homeless, you should all be treated the same, with the same respect, the same amount of things. And the same goes with, like, regular people like us, and also celebrities. People count them as, like superior different people but they're people like us and they have feelings too so when you rip on them understand that it hurts them okay it's not like think about if every day you were getting people hating on you who you didn't even know hating on you from what they saw okay how would you feel okay if you like it you're messed up because why would you like getting hated on like that's terrible and then you go and hate on other people. Like, I understand. Some people are taking it far with the celebrity stuff, okay? But, I mean, it doesn't mean you go hating on them. You don't even know them. How about you try to get to know them first before you judge them? That's a huge problem we as Americans have. We as any other place. Like, there's too many places to name. <laughs> <laughs> it's insane. And we're like... And then all these wars. Why are we having wars? It goes back to the point. People want to be more superior over each other. They they can't sit down at a table and negotiate. Exactly. They, they have to go over, get nukes, and start <laughs> bombing other places to be like, I like want to prove a point. I want to be superior over you all, which doesn't make sense. Because negotiating is what people do. If you can go over to a table and just sit down and negotiate for like 10 minutes, there probably wouldn't there'd probably be like 50% less wars, I guarantee it. Yeah, and maybe you could discover that you actually like the person who you were about to kill. Why? <laughs> like you sit down with them. What if they became your best friend but you wanted to kill them before? Why are you killing innocent citizens to get a piece of land to get new technology like what is the point why is there borders okay why can't we share there's like all this land that was given to us some people believe it was given from other um from like gods or statues or whatever you believe in um but it was given to us and we need to use it we are we are destroying our world because we think we're the superior beings. Okay, we think we're the superior time. We think with all this technology, it's going to get us farther than, I don't know, uh, right now we're, like, really against North Korea or whatever, and we're trying to see who can get the better technology, the better nukes and stuff. And what's happening is we're killing each other by killing innocent citizens, and then people are going crazy, and one day we're going to tear our parts, a, like, apart. Yeah. Also, people with animals, they may think that they're superior more than animals, and just because they can't talk, just because they may not have as big as a brain of us, it's so inhumane. Like, it's, it's humane to take a dog, you can keep a dog, you can take her on walks, you can take... Care of it. They're taking them, they're trading them, they're big, it's basically abuse to all things, and 
it's ridiculous why you want to bas basically kill off basically extinct animals. Basically, basically, basically. And then you turn around on the news, and this is you guys, okay? Well, all of us. I'm not saying it's just you guys, but it's all of us. You're like, oh, we need to um, reserve this animal because it's instinct. Take it into zoos. Take it into zoos. No, what you need to do is you need to stop hunting it, okay? I'm not a vegetarian, so I... Like, you don't have to take my word for this, okay? Because I'm not, like, I'm still eating meat. I love meat, okay? But if I had the choice to keep our animals or eat meat, I would keep our animals. Because you know what? Then it's only going to be us. And you know what's going to happen? We're going to kill each other. People are so crazy over meat that we will kill each other to get meat. Humans will be the next delicacy, okay? That's going to be the next delicacy. And we, we want to be so superior this is what the food chain will be homeless people and then like people in apartments people middle class wealthy and then like rich you're gonna have the rich buying like rpgs and shooting people down just for their flesh and meat like people exactly. don't well uh, people don't want to grow a garden they're too lazy to bend over and pick a couple of plants and this is going back again to why people think they're superior. And then another reason is that we think, like I said before, that we're so superior with our new technology, okay? But get this. Back when none of us were alive, like before Christ, if you want to use um, BC, uh, before Christ, there were Egyptians who built pyramids out of we don't even know what. They had no technology, people. They did it. And you know what? Um, They had slaves, okay? I understand that. That was wrong of them. But still, they worked together. And the slaves ended up leaving and escaping if you believe in the Bible. But if you don't believe in the Bible, then you may have a different story. But um, me personally, I think that happened. But why were there slaves? And a lot of people think, um, when they think of slaves, they think of, like, black people, okay? Um, and actually, the first slaves were white people. But they got confused, so they went to Africa and took black people on... Um, took people on a boat and crossed the boat and I actually watched there's a movie called Roots and what they did is they put them down below in these beds and they stayed there for however long the boat ride was they peed on themselves they barely got any food they got sicknesses um and the people who died they wouldn't even take out their bodies and then they would take women up and rape them rape them because women had no rights and especially black people didn't have any rights and when the first black man got his rights the black woman did not so i'm just saying okay it went from like pg ranting to like r rating but that's what happens x. yeah x rating right <laughs> i can't even say it i'm so mad right now like why why did we need slaves can't we do the work ourselves the people are too lazy. They want more power than what's needed. People are getting lazier by the century. And as we're developing, like, new medicines and stuff, the people are going to get lazier and fatter and chubbier. Mm -hmm. They're not ever going to want to do the work. Eventually, I think we're going to have robot slaves. And people will be fighting over that. Like, who's going to, what country's going to get more, um, like, material or whatever. Exactly. They're, they're going to be fighting for whatever cause they want because they just want to have the most power. They want to be the most lazy country ever. They want everything done for them. Mm -hmm. And then why do people feel the need to start trying to predict things? So what's happening is scientists are predicting whenever, um, we're going to get burned by the sun or when um, the earth is going to end or whatever. And the need for that, I don't need like to think about that because thinking about that literally is terrifying. Think right? about thinking about how life well, is in the afterlife. You, it's basically impossible to think about nothing. And what if there is no afterlife? Like some people don't believe there's an afterlife. What is it? Like, I've been trying to think about that. I believe in the afterlife, but if there isn't, is it just you're gone from existence? What is your mind? Is it blank? Can you, you can't see anything. Is it just a black void for the rest of eternity? Like, what is it? Okay, I don't get it. Um, why people also have to judge people on, um, 
the religion, okay? You don't have to agree, okay? I understand that some people are um, Christian, some people are Baptist. Well, Baptist is Christian, but some Buddhist, people are Christian. Muslim. Buddhist, Muslim. Yeah, Muslim. There's all these different religions, okay? So why are we beating ourselves up over that? And then some people are blaming um, the Muslims for what is happening around the world. You know not every Muslim is bad? I'm just yeah, throwing that not, out there. Not a lot of Muslims are bad. People are literally killing innocent Muslims just because they think they're a part of ISIS. But it's just so stupid. Mm-hmm. Just to think because someone is that religion, and then a small portion of that religion turned into something so bad that that religion is, like, being hurt so much. Exactly. And, you know, I brought this point up is because my my favorite YouTubers, I see it in the comments below. Um, people are asking her why, like, asking these YouTubers, why is this happening? We're being killed and hunted because we're this religion. We're being bullied. Some of them are saying, I'm a Muslim, and I go to, like, a Catholic school, and people are bullying me to the point where I don't even want to be alive. Help. That's literally what they're saying, okay? And nobody else is listening, okay? So I'm here to say today to listen. Just listen. This has been our rant. Timmy, anything else to add? Just, 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 like, don't control power. Exactly. You, you you have again you people who have a home you have enough you have a family you have money you don't need much more you don't need to turn other people down you don't need to hurt them more than they already are hurt because you don't know what problems they're having in life you don't know what kind of things they ha- could have gotten into so if your life is fine if you don't need anything don't make your life better, which I don't know how, by just beating on others down, because it's just so stupid. I know if I had the choice ever, like, if I created, like, if I was one of the first people alive, and around the time when money first came out, I would banish money. I would not make it. I would try to convince people to work together. Who came up with racism? Who came up with um, being sexist? Who came up with these things? Who came up with putting us into sections, okay? Black, white, Asian. <laughs> like, there's three... You're forgetting, um, like, 30 other races. Yeah. Indian, like, so much others. Exactly, but my mind is like, oh, I can't even think right now. Anyways, this is our rant. Thank you guys for watching. Just think about this. Why do we think we're better?